Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Amari Jackson. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Tuesday, February 4th, 2020. Let's go to Nathaniel to see what happened today in history. Thank you, Amari. Today in history on February 4th, 1994, Richard I, King of England, is freed from captivity in Germany. Now let's go to Jane to see what happened for lunch. Thank you, Nathaniel. Today for lunch, we have three cheese panini, tomato soup, potato wedges, diced pears, and your choice of milk. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Amari. Thank you, Jaden. That sounds delicious. In school news, our Valentine's Day dance is on February 13th for grades K through 5. For grades 6 through 8, Valentine's Grand Specials are on sale. Pre-sale tickets will end at February 10th. Payments will only be taken during lunch. Now let's go to Weather with Ernst. Thank you, Amari. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 80 degrees Fahrenheit and partly cloudy. Now let's go back to Amari. Thank you, Ernst. On admin announcements, teachers, please be at your door to welcome your scholars at 7.35 a.m. Attendance must be taken at 8.30 a.m. Lastly, teachers, don't forget to provide your scholars with positive hero points. Patriots, don't forget your Pat's expectations. It represents... Present yourself... Treat the school environment respectfully and succeed at everything. Congrats, Mrs. Scotto, Miss Anaya, Miss Richardson, and Mrs. Kane. You had the correct answer to the trivia question, which was, in what year did Supreme Court ruling on Brown versus Board of Education end racial segregation in public schools? The correct answer to the trivia question was 1954. Now for today's tri Black History Month trivia. What former First Lady won her first Grammy Award for the Best Spoken Word album? Repeat. What former First Lady won her first Grammy Award for Best Spoken Word Album? Teachers, send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. And remember, reset your mindset. Have a great day.